Hello everyone, welcome to African Diaspora News Channel. I'm your host, Ray Kembabazi from Kampala, Uganda. So many times, medical books use light-skinned models as examples of how to note disease symptoms. This usually makes it a very challenging for doctors to diagnose these diseases on people with dark or brown skin tones. So a second year medical student known as Malone Mukwende from the St. George University of London launched a handbook to address this problem. The handbook is called Mind the Gap and it compares different skin conditions on dark and light skin and provides students and healthcare professionals with proper identification and descriptions of the skin's reaction to multiple diseases. Malone Mukwende's book will be launched in the coming months after more than 186,000 people signed a petition arguing British medical schools to include BEM representation in clinical teaching. They pointed out Kawasaki disease, a rare condition that mainly affects children under the age of five. On white skin, this appears as a red blotchy rash, but it's much harder to spot on darker skin. On arrival at medical school, Malone Mukwende noted that there was a gap or a lack of diversity in the way that they were being taught. They were often asked to look for symptoms such as red rashes, on which he was very aware that they would not appear as such on someone with his same skin tone. When he asked his tutors, it was very clear to him that they did not know how to describe those symptoms for someone with a darker skin tone and they often time advised him to go and find it or look it out for himself. This showed him that he had to do something to bridge the gap in the current medical education. Malone Mukwende took it to his Twitter to express what actually inspired him. So I'm going to quote his tweet. He says, but what will it look like on darker skin? A question I've often asked myself during my time at medical school. This constant celebration led me to curate a handbook that presents clinical features on darker skin. I hope this resource shifts the culture of medical education. Malone Mukwende says that he hopes that his handbook called Mind the Gap will become a staple in all institutions in the UK and all over the world eventually. He goes on to say that medical professionals should be aware of the various ways that symptoms of a similar disease could present itself on people of different skin tones. And he also goes on to say that he hopes that his book is going to encourage people of darker and brown skin tones give them confidence to go and seek medical attention from different hospitals or medical centers wherever they may be. Thank you so much for watching and catch you on the next story. Bye.